He's about to go in. Blizzard, who hasn't done a huge amount wrong so far this campaign. He is quite an attractive price, isn't he? If you don't fancy the uh, top two in the market, three places each way as well, you're getting a little bit of value. Lucky Bubble's about to go in. DB Pin goes forward. Just waiting now for this short price favourite, Mr. Stunning. He of the glittering CV so far this season. They're in, stand by. <laughs> And they're off for the centenary sprint of 2018 and Pennyophobia blasted out. Mr. Stunning got a very good start as well, not listening to me up the inside. Blizzard wants to move forward as well. Bit of a gap then to Lucky Bubbles, DB pin a little bit wide on the track at the moment. Then Lucky Year and Beat the Clock is right at the rear of the field but will be no more than about six lengths behind as they begin to make the turn here and make their way down towards the final 800. Pennyophobia trying to slow things down out in front as he did last year. To Blizzard in second, not listening to me, a length back to Mr. Stunning. Then up the inside, Lucky Year, DB Pin continues his wide trek. Then Lucky Bubbles in the pink headgear and beat the clock who's at the rear of the field, making the swing now towards the final 500 metres. And it's Pennyophobia out in front. Blizzard now taking aim in second. Mr. Stunning is making his way through the race nicely, not listening to me, is sticking around the inside rail. Bit of a gap to DB Pin as they go inside the final 350 now. And it's Blizzard who takes it up to Pennyophobia. Not listening to me, is trying to stay on. Here comes Mr. Stunning now and DB Pin getting into gear down the centre of the course as well. Inside the final 200 they go and it's Mr Stunning who takes it up to DB Pin, Beat the Clock is finishing really strongly as well, Mr Stunning flagging, DB Pin is reeling him in, DB Pin, the new kid on the block got there and beat into second, Beat the Clock followed then by Mr Stunning in third, then Lucky Year and Blizzard not listening to me, Pennyophobia and Lucky Bubbles. DB Pin gets his revenge over Mr Stunning who did look a little bit flat in the latter stages and DB Pin who was a little bit unlucky here back in December in the big group one sprint has managed to get his head in front of mr stunning beat the clock has run a cracker he could well have nabbed second over the favorite it's going to be tight for the miners the head of mr stunning somewhat obscured there by the big frame of db pin lucky years run out of his skin to finish in fourth and blizzard not listening to me and then it was tight at the back there between pennyophobia and lucky bubbles but db pin he always looked a good one and he's come on